During my placement with Amadis IT Services in London, I worked with a lot of projects, the best one being the chatbot. And in this, we developed a chatbot which could help you search for flights and then you can go on to the website and book those. We used artificial intelligence and machine learning for this, which was a very interesting part of learning. So the role at ZF that I did was a brakes engineering placement. In that role, I entered into design, development, project management, and also mentoring. So I got a taste of everything on my placement. It's kind of like a graduate scheme almost. My role was a private aviation advisor. So my key responsibilities was tailoring a private jet flight to high net worth individuals, celebrities, and uh, other people who can afford to fly private jets. So uh, the key responsibility was basically uh, we worked as a broker, so we didn't own any private jets. So uh, I had to find a private jet for them that suits their need and uh, ensure the safety of the flight. Well, there's two real elements to it. The first was the job. It was an operational environment. No two days were the same. And I always loved waking up in the morning knowing that I was going into an environment that I would thrive in. The second really was the actual environment. I'm a bit of an aviation enthusiast and being around aircraft was kind of a dream come true for me. It was uh, definitely the opportunity working with uh, a different kind of celebrities, meeting them face to face, as well as also using the private jet flight so I understand what I'm offering to my clients. Uh, so I had uh, several opportunities. I went once to Mykonos and uh, once to Paris. The thing I enjoyed most being on a placement um, was the amount of support I received from my colleagues and the, the working environment. Everything was new to me as this was my first um, year of experience. So I, I kind of tried to soak up as much knowledge as possible. EC Futures helped me to secure my placement by first of all going through my CV and working with me on what it is that I needed to match to the job description. We then moved forward into interviewing techniques and I sat down with some of the EEC Futures team to go through how best to approach talking to my future boss. EEC Futures has been there in every highlight of my placement. They started with giving me a highlight on how I can make a CV or how I can secure a placement. They helped me with my mock interviews. The whole process had been jot down for me and they've been there at every step telling me how to filter jobs, how to apply or which one would be perfect for me. EEC Futures team um, was there for me throughout the whole application and throughout the whole process. Um, I received just amazing amount of support throughout application, interview preparation. Definitely sign up for a placement. It's the best thing you can do. It makes you more employable. You get to earn money for a year and also you get a lot of experience. So you can link your academic knowledge that you've learned in university <coughs> with real life experiences. My advice for students that are thinking about doing a placement is definitely do a placement. It is 100% the best thing you can do. I wouldn't be standing here right now talking to you if I didn't think it was that good. The first thing I would say is start now. It's never too early to apply for any kind of placement. Start with your interviews, start with your appointment, appointment getting booked with EEC Futures and start jotting down your CV and get ready and get rolling. Don't be disheartened if you don't get it. I remember the number of times I applied and then I got it into the right kind of internship. So please don't give up and start applying as early as you can.